I think we're live. It takes a little while to get a meditative mind into the technology mind. So welcome if anyone is here um, or if you're watching the recording, I'm happy to see you. I'm Linda Rosenthal and it is my honor to um, have shifted from when Good of the Whole first um, um, launched the Love Lives Here, 40 Days of Reconnection. We were joined together and for 40 days, we focused on four main aspects of our lives. And we were expressing how we shared love for ourselves and then for others and then for the earth and then for the sacred in all things. And some months went by, I did the 40 days for all of those. And it just came to me to do a 40 day uh, meditation for healing for others. And I thought this was a perfect day. It certainly is a time where we feel others pain. And um, so I wanted to offer 40 days of uh, chanting a mantra 108 times. Um, for the benefit of others. It has nothing to do with me or my healing. And, um, and yet it has everything to do with me and my healing because it's just another way of expressing love and being in service. So I, I'm delighted that you're here and just wanted to talk to you a little bit. I'm not going to be chanting publicly with you, um, although I do recommend that you learn about doing a mantra and how to find one that resonates with you. Um, for me, for the next 40 days, I will be chanting a mantra um, that, let me uh, just explain it to you. It's basically calling on and using seed sounds of um, vibrations that bring healing. So this is for the removal of any obstacles that could bring healing to you or remove any obstacles that would um, keep you from finding for yourself the right path to take for healing. Whether it's finding the right um, holistic practitioner or nutritionist or um, exercise therapist or therapist or, um, or doctor where your healing can be helped by the right um, the right aids, the right helpers. So we call on the celestial healer of the Han Van Tre. And, um, and, and the intention, very important to set an intention before you um, start your meditation practice. And when you set that intention, and for me, it's for your healing, I've asked for you to place your names um, and hello from New Hampshire and hello to um, Julie and to everyone else who's joining us or will be seeing the recording. Now today, at, it's one o'clock central time on Saturday of Labor Day holiday weekend. Many of you are out with your families or doing whatever you're doing. You're at the beach, you're on your boat, you're getting your kids ready for school. But this is the time that I'm here. And this is also the weekend of the funeral of Senator John McCain. And uh, I know that our attention is, is being taken many different places. When I think about healing for others, as I've been getting names of people, I want to um, include others who are suffering or hurting in any way. And my mind went to the people in Syria or those in Puerto Rico who haven't um, had assistance or help since their hurricane. And so many people have died and so many families affected. I think of the uh, many, many children who've been separated from their families at our borders. And, um, and then personally, so many people who are in the hospital or are hurting in any way or suffering or need surgeries um, or have been diagnosed with diseases that people are reaching out. And people at this time want to know that there's more 
to healing. There's the healing means to be whole. And in my small act of service, I'm going to come into my healing room every day. Um, hopefully it'll be the same day in the morning, uh, uh, the same time every morning, you know, or it might be in the evening or it might be twice a day that I'm going to be using my mala beads and I'm going to be chanting for your healing. So please in the comments below, um, uh, put your name or you can uh, register and we'll have your name to know that it's going to be on my altar. And you're going to register at goodofthewhole.com slash 40. Uh, oh, no, I'm sorry. It's goodofthewhole.com slash healing for the number for others. Healing for others. If you go to that page and that website, you'll... Um, find a little place to register. And when we get your email and your name, and that's all you need to do. So that alerts me um, if, you, if you have more that you wanna talk about, and I've gotten so many emails already um, of, of people who um, sometimes are going very deeply into the healing that they want and need. Um, feel free to do that. You can also contact me at www.insightout I-N-S-I-G-H-T-O-U-T dash healing dot com forward slash contact dot H-T-M-L. And you can leave a message for me and I will add that um, to the list that I will have right on my altar, lighting a candle for you, saying this mantra, uh, which I will tell you now is Om Boom, Om Shri, Dahan Van Tre Namaha. I'll say that 108 times. You don't need to know what it is unless you want to join along with me, and I'm happy to help you with that. Um, it's OM. We're uh, um, inviting the great universe, that primordial sound. GUM, which is the seed sound for Gana, uh, Ganesha that removes any kind of obstacles. Uh, and OM SHRI. It's a seed sound for abundance for um, uh, Lakshmi to bring the abundance of good health to you. And that health can mean physical, mental, emotional, spiritual, um, overall health in your relationships, um, health in your attitude. And um, Dahan Van Tre is the celestial healer. And Namaha is a, a salutations to that. It's kind of like saying, so be it. And so it is in our prayer. Now, because these words are in Sanskrit, don't let that ch chase you away or you don't understand it. Find a mantra that means something to you if you want to start this mala practice, such as, um, I am healed, I am whole, or um, I see the world as healed. This is healing for others. Or it's uh, like intercessory prayer where you can say what you want, um, maybe whatever word comes to you, or even um, the rosary, praying the rosary, or saying shalom, which is peace, peace to the world. Um, so you'll find what resonates with you. Om Shanti 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 is peace, bringing peace. And I think that is the way that we heal. When we have peace within ourselves, we can have peace with the world, with others. Um, our bodies feel that vibration of peace. When you chant your mantra, you'll be creating that same vibration over and over and over, which begins to um, uh, change the makeup of your physical body. And we do it 108 times because there's 108 nadis through our body that, that reach in and connect at the heart. When they connect at the heart, you know that your mind is slowing down and the love that you are is being activated. Now that's changing all systems within you. And if there's health that you're looking for, this does bring results. I just suggest that you um, sit back and relax for the next 40 days 
knowing that you are included. This is for the good of the whole. And it's not just that, that our organization is good of the whole. This is for the good of all people, all people. We all need to feel that we are loved, that we are accepted, that we have prayers being said for us. Whatever situation that we're in, uh, know that you are being um, held with a sacred altar, with your name, with the intention that whatever it is that you need comes to you. Whatever it is that will bring you wholeness and peace and healing and happiness. That's why we're doing this. That's why I'm doing this. And I invite you to, to do this. Uh, please contact me uh, through Inside Out or through Good of the Whole or on my Facebook page. And um, I'm happy to get back to you um, or explain things a little bit more. Just be watching over the next 40 days. I'll be checking in live again, maybe on Friday evenings, uh, right before sundown when the Sabbath is to begin. So these are sacred times and um, and putting ourselves in a position of being able to offer our compassionate service to others is what this is about for the next 40 days. So love lives here. I know that love is continuing to live where you are. And if you're hurting in any way, please add your name to the list and register at goodofthewhole.com slash healing for others. I don't, I don't have the URL down pat, but um, check out Good of the Holes page and you'll find us. Um, I'm happy that you're here. I don't want to take any more of your time because I know it's a holiday weekend, but I'll be checking in with you and I do hope that you'll check in with us. Know that we love you. I'll be chanting for you. And in the true um, bodhisattva um, aspect of devotion, and love for humanity, um, I offer this. So we are one, we are whole, we are complete, we are already healed. Um, and sometimes we do ask for assistance. It helps along the way. So um, Om Boom, Om Shri, Dahan Van Tre, Namaha. And Namaste to you. Thank you so much for joining me. Bye, bye for now. Have a beautiful, healthy, happy weekend and week ahead.